Guys, before the video starts, we are very close to 11,000 subscribers. The best thing you can do for me right now is by clicking subscribe. If you've already done it, don't worry. Thanks very much and enjoy the video. Daniel, we spoke very early on this season, didn't we? About, I think uh, it was the end of last season. It I think it was, was after it? the Watford game, yeah. Okay. I think I stood here and said, I think we need two seasons yeah. to go back up. Um, I th hoped we'd have done better this season, although in retrospect, I do think if we'd have gone up via automatics again, we'd have the same problem again. Mm. You know, everybody would probably have had the contracts renewed because you've done it again yeah. and we'll still be in that cycle that we're stuck in. So it would have been good to have got in the playoffs, although then we waste two weeks in the playoffs, you know, if, if you don't, don't go up that route. So I guess, you know, we are where we are. I mean, as football fans, you always want the best for your football club. But I, I must admit, yeah. admit, I agree with you. I think we do need yeah. this season just to regroup. We need a big summer ahead. Look, there's lots of work to be done. But do you yeah. think Stuart Webber and whoever the head coach may be is the right sort of pair to do it? Yes. Yeah, yeah. I like I like what I've seen so far. Although, you know, you've got to back up words of actions, haven't you? You know, he's, he's saying the right things. He's doing the right things. Um, I like the fact, you know, he seems to be if you like doing his business early you know releasing the players a big shock that Ruddy went to be honest with you um, glad that he got the send off today that he did um, I think he deserved that you know he's, he's rightly so some games this season had fans on his back yeah. but you know you've got to look at seven seasons or seven years you know and what he got today he deserved glad that he got a clean sheet I think a few of the players were trying to get a penalty I had this feeling <laughs> yeah. that if we'd have had a penalty Ruddy was going to come up and have a punt and that would have been you know you know, great, but you know, it was good that we played the final game with some fun, but also you know took it took it seriously. And as you know, right at the end, I was uh, in line with for the fourth goal, and Jerome could have just tapped that in the goal, and he didn't. You know, he obviously you know sent it out. You know, unselfish for for Houlihan, and you know it was good. You know, two I mean, from, in two from ways. yeah, in terms of of Ruddy, I, I I do completely agree. He's been here seven seasons. He's been a good servant, yeah. but at the same time. He, do you think letting go of him is part of this whole kind of rebuild? He's on fairly big money for a yeah. goalkeeper. You yeah. can't get sentimental about these things, can you? No, no, no. I, I agree. I, I think it's good for everyone because he's not the ruddy he was. Mm. And I reckon he'll go to another team and we'll probably sit there going, oh, I wish we'd kept him because he'll probably get his form back, yeah. you know. And you know, it's just good for everyone. You know, he needs to move on. Um, we need we need to move on. I, I, I'm not convinced by any of the other keepers that we've got at the moment, though. You know, I do think maybe we do need to. You know, we need to get a new number one and not just rely. You know, because at the moment, you know, what have we got left in defence? I think it's Martin, isn't it? Martin, <laughs> not and, many. <laughs> Martin and, and Ben Godfrey, and you know, again, perhaps probably would like to have seen Whitaker today. Mm. Um, would have been you know would have been nice for him to come on, but then maybe that was too sentimental. You know, it's, I think Whitaker's been good this season. You know, there's a few of the others who have been around the fringes of the team. Maybe you know. You could argue maybe they've you know pulled a bit of a sulk you know or, or whatever. Yeah. Um, Whitaker I think's always been you know professional, done what's been asked of him, one year extension. I think that you know got a lot of stick for that, but I think it was right to have extended him for one season rather than bring somebody else in. You know, he knew the club, knew the system. Whenever he's been asked to do something, he's come on, given it his best, been a true professional. Whenever you've heard him in interviews, mm -hmm. you know, good luck to him as well. You know, I hope hope he goes on and and, and does well. You I suppose know? The, the only positive we can take from this season is we've shown that we can do it. If you yeah. know. Yeah. At times we've been incredible, but yeah. at other times we've been truly woeful. So yeah, I suppose I we can take that into next season, can't we? Yeah, no, absolutely. And I don't. I think we need to be careful that you know we don't cliche again. You know, don't chuck out the baby with the bathwater. You know, we've got a good attacking unit there. I'd love to, I'd love Wes to stay. You know, he needs his testimonial. Mm. Um, you know, that would be good. But then the question is, you know, we've got Wes. Pritchard and Madison and Naismith and Naismith can we although I think Naismith can be a slightly different player you know I see Wes Pritchard Madison you know those three really really creative players and you, you know at home you can play two of them away you can't necessarily and therefore one of them is going to get the nose pushed out of joint so it's kind of you know it's a big decision if a good offer comes in for one of them do you take it? You know, we need we need money in the bank. Um, you know, and, and I think a smaller squad will help us as well. I do think sometimes we've been hindered by a big squad. You know, somebody's form drops a bit. Rather than like, no, you go out there and you fix it. You put somebody else on who's then coming up to speed until their form drops, and yeah. then you bring that play another player back in. And we have been a little bit too chop and change, I think, over the course of the season. So you know, let's let's see what next season um, has to bring. Um, you know, I still think we need another striker as well. I do think, as, as well as fixing the back, a striker, but middle of the park, I think we're sorted. Mate, top okay. man. Thank you very much.